Hey everyone, I am back. So I don't think that I have came on here and properly introduced myself. So I am Tessa, I'm the owner of Silk and Honey for those of you all who don't know me. And I just recently opened up my first brick and mortar store. We were online for, we were online for two years now, back in August, two years, it made two years in August, I think, yes, pretty sure. But, um, so today I just decided to like vlog my day and, you know, just show you all like what I do on a day to day basis. So I'm still trying to get the hang of things and the flow because, you know, I'm not used to having to actually be in a location and come to work. Like online is completely different from in store. You definitely have a little bit more freedom if you're just online, like to get up and go versus like when you have a store, you have set hours, you have to be here if you don't have anyone, but I just hired my first employee. So hopefully you guys will get to meet her. So let me show you all around the store. So this is what the outside looks like. They're doing some kind of construction work. Oh, if you don't know, we're located in downtown Memphis. And then this is the front of the store. And then we're just gonna go in. So as soon as you walk in, like right here, I try to have like my little gift area, you know, like if people don't buy any clothes, I'd still would want them to at least find something cute to walk out with. So that's what we have here. And then we have our little lounge area right here. It was a table right here, but I put it outside next to the sill rack because I put like some cute little dog toys on it. Like I said, we're downtown and I'm around a lot of apartments. So everyone is always walking their dog. And that's our little mannequin display. This mirror actually goes in there. I'm gonna show you where it goes. And then this is our checkout counter. Those hats, I'm hanging those up here along this wall. I was gonna do it around the mirror, but I kind of need this plain wall space for when I do photo shoots for our social media. And this is our little display table. Those are getting moved. This is getting moved. This is getting moved. And like these little accessories and stuff like that is getting moved off this table and it's gonna get moved right here. I just got a new shelf for that. And this is our little hanging rack. We got some new stuff in. We just got this cute new sweater. It is so comfortable and soft. Like look how thick this is. So soft. I see um, she hung all this stuff up today. We actually just got this and this and a few more other pieces in. I'll show you guys those. Then we have the back wall. This is our little workout area. It's very bare right now. I don't usually sell workout stuff, but I wanted to, you know, try something different. Cause like I said, people, they work out around here and they walk their dog, so. I have that there. The bathroom's there. These are our fitting rooms. I am obsessed with our fitting rooms. I'm so happy how they turned out. I had to get our rods custom made because all of the ones that were online were either too small or not big enough. Like I wanted it the perfect size to where people could come in and still like step back and have enough room to like take pictures. Then we have these cute little teddy coats. This top is new. You guys, I have ordered so much print. Our little mash chains, these are so cute. And all of this is available online. I will put the link down below, of course, for you all. Look like we done sold some earrings here. But yeah, this is our little setup so far. It's gonna change, but yeah. I kinda look a mess right now, but it's okay. Like, it's okay. But anyways, usually when I get here, so the first thing that I do is I put our open sign outside and I put our cell rack outside so people can like know that we're here. Cause like I said, we just 
moved in like two weeks ago or our first official day opening was about two weeks ago. So people still don't know we're over here yet. So I'm still trying to, you know, figure out ways to get the word out that we're open and we're over here and then we're in the neighborhood and all that. So I'll just put the cell rack outside and then I will come over here. I just have some stuff here. I'll put our iPad up. So what we do is, I don't know where we can hide our iPad. I'll leave it here. So usually we just put it under here. And our card reader is under here too. And I use Shopify. And we do remove all of our change, well, all of our dollar bills out. We leave the change in case, you know, people try to rob us or anything. Then I'll put that in there. Let me clock in. And of course, I had to get my daily dose of coffee. I really don't drink coffee that much. And if I do drink it, I only get it from McDonald's. Like, I will not drink Starbucks coffee at all. It's just, it's so bitter to me. Like, I like sweet coffee. So, I don't know if y'all have heard of it, but we use home base for like our clock in system. So, we go right here. You just clock in and it'll take your picture. And boom, that's it. So cute. I love it. Okay, so that's done um let's see then i just you know sit here and do nothing no i'm just kidding i'll look at my calendar and see what i have planned for the day i need to figure out what i'm gonna post on social media i'm so trying to get better at planning out the entire week as far as what i post but i run out of ideas and i just don't know but i do know today i've noticed owning a store it gets so dusty like so dusty today is gonna be deep cleaning day so when i close today i'm gonna have to deep clean the entire store because there's dust like everywhere and it's it's crazy like there's do you see that there's like so much dust on this sheet i don't know but today's gonna be deep cleaning for the store today let's see we have a we just started a local brand ambassador program so i have a girl coming in today that's gonna do a try on and take some pictures and stuff for our social media so i probably could post that today and i am trying to figure out tiktok oh my gosh i've been hearing like a lot of people's stories saying that tiktok has been working for them so i'm still trying to figure that out if you have any tips on tiktok like let me know because i'm trying to figure it out and oh yeah i need to post i need to finish posting new arrivals on the website we have so many new arrivals going up tomorrow Today's Thursday, tomorrow's Friday. We have new arrivals every Friday. But yeah, I still need to do that. Mm. I'm gonna try to come on here and start recording more videos and posting more videos, but I don't know what you all want to see or want to know, so 
If there's anything specific you want to see or you want to know, just let me know in the comments. Um, I might try to do like what Kat does. Her name's Kat, so she's our store manager. The girl that I just hired that I mentioned earlier. I might like let her record and tell you all what she do on a day-to-day -day basis, even though she kind of like just started like a week ago, but she's been really awesome, you guys. Like I really, so for the past two years, I've been like solo dolo. Like it's just been me. Well, I had one person that helped me run my social media, but still I did most of the, she handles and runs everything as far as the storefront. Like I just want to be the person that comes here and like, she tells me like, hey, I have this, 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 and this plan. Does this work? Or, you know, just basically I go down a checklist and just approve everything or be like, no, this isn't gonna work. So let's change this and do it this way. That's all I wanna do. But as far as the online store, I wanna focus more on the online store because I'm still trying to build our online presence. Like, I don't know why, but getting online sales for me has been a little challenging it's always been challenging for me. Like I still get online sales, but like every single day on a day-to-day -day basis, I don't get online sales. Like I don't get online sales every single day. And I'm trying to get to a point where I can get online sales every single day. Cause like we do have slow days in store. So when we have slow days in store, I want to make up for that online, you know? But um, yeah, so I will see you guys later. Okay, so I'm back. Picking up the camera and recording is very challenging because I always forget to like pick it up. But anyways, what I'm doing right now is I just finished posting on Instagram. I posted like our final few so people know like what sizes we have that we're limited on. But I bought some new baskets yesterday because I needed some new ones to put our mask in and our dog toys. So yeah, that's what I'm finna do right now. Let me show you. So I don't know if I want to put these masks in that basket or in that basket over there and put the wine bags over there. I'm just gonna try both of them and see. Then another thing, it's difficult holding the camera and trying to do stuff. Okay, so I'm gonna set you all right here and I'll be back. I haven't forgot to show you all like all the new arrivals that we've got in also so I'm still gonna do that okay so let's see if I want to put okay, I don't need these scissors and then put them back so these are the masks that we have they are currently $12 they are online if you all want some or need some it's breast cancer awareness month so these pink ones are really cute for that so, do I like the mask in this basket or well, this is what the mask looks like? I think the wine bags would be better because I have so many of them. I have so many wine bags. Oh, let me show you all. Okay, so these are really cute for gifts too. So if you're Christmas shopping early for gifts, these are really cute. That's why I got these. So this one says, keep pouring. That's all. For the car ride home, that's all. Sometimes alcohol is just necessary. That's all. <laughs> okay, and then we just got these in. These cute little metallic ones. I don't know. These are for like all my wine lovers. Like, I know some of y'all love wine and drink wine every night. Me personally, I don't drink like that. So, this 
isn't something I would buy. This one says, in case of emergencies, that's all. <laughs> I do not think all of these are going to fit in here. I might need to leave them in here. This one says, celebrate. This one's like a different kind of material. This might, I don't know. What this, I don't know what kind of material this is. This is, this one's cute though. That one will be in the back. Okay, so this is what we're working with with the wine bags in it. Wine bags or mask. Let me know in the comments which one, which one y'all will put in here. What I think I'm going to do is put... <sighs> what did I get that other basket for? That's what I'm trying to think of. Don't remember what I was going to put in this one. I think I was going to put the dog toys in here. <coughs> okay, so I have the dog toys. So we had this cute one. It's the little Starbucks cup. Of course, I had to get one for my male dogs. And they make noise. How cute is this? It says Chewy baton chewy baton that one's cute chewy baton too for my bougie girls and this one says birthday boy and then we got this one in a little circle one so yeah so i had to put the camera down for a minute because i had a few customers walk in so this is what it's looking like the mask are there and the wine bags are over there i am like so bare on accessories right now but i am never gonna run out of accessories again because i just did not know people down here really like accessories but i have a lot more coming in and i know this table is busy right now but hopefully it will not be after this afternoon when i put the other shelves up because all of this is going to be gone like i really want this table to be nothing but clothes and accessories but i like these two little touches because people when they shop here they can just grab that stuff i noticed that they look right here more than they look right here which is where like all of our little gifty stuff is gonna be but um yeah i might put like um two little small shelves like those right here i got those from ikea and then put like some more little gifty stuff there because i feel like people are more comfortable shopping back here since they're like by themselves and they're not so close to us up front so that's probably what i'm gonna do with that okay so what i'm gonna do now is go ahead and try to put well not try i need to because i have so much stuff that i need to put online I'm going to try and put all of our new arrivals that go live tomorrow online that are available in store. It's, it's a lot. It's a lot. But, um, we got to do it. Don't it? We got to do it, baby. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and show you all our some of our new arrivals. I'm not going to try any of it on right now because I just don't have time because it's 1 o'clock. And I just remembered that I have a girl that's coming to do a try on later. And I probably won't have time after that because, like I said, I still have to put all the new arrivals online. And that's going to take some time. I'm trying to do everything here and not have to go home and work. So first we have this cute little baby doll dress. It's very lightweight and it is currently $49. It's such a good deal. It's really cute for fall. You can put like a cardigan over it and wear some long black boots or some booties. This is really cute. This has been a really good seller for us. And this sweater, 
when I got this sweater, I did not think it was going to be like this thick. Can you tell how thick and soft this is? Like it is so soft and comfortable. I did not think it was going to be like this, but I'm really glad that I got it. Let's see. What else do we have new? We got this lightweight sweater well every everything in the store is probably gonna be new to y'all because y'all really haven't seen like everything that we have but if there's something specific that you want to see just go online and you can check it out and um if you want to know like the fit size and material then you can email us or you can dm us on instagram at shop silk and honey so this is another cute little lightweight sweater that we have this one's really cute. I think I, this is really cute. I got this for like people that don't like tight fitted stuff, like, cause we have a lot of that. So I try to mix it up a little bit for those people that like, you know, flowy, loose stuff in the oversized fits. And <clears throat> we have this cute tie-dye shirt jacket. This has been a really good seller for us. Like, it has been selling good. We've only had it in for a week and we already only have three sizes left, which is a medium and a large. So if you really want this, go cop it. Selling out quick. And we don't restock items, but I might restock that one. We have this cute little top. I think this is like nude floral print. This one's really cute. This one isn't online yet and this fleece set this is so cute like when i got this i did not think that this was gonna be like this is like kind of a thick material it's not lightweight which is good because it's getting cooler so you can still be cute but you might like if you sweat a lot like i sweat a lot so i probably sweat in this and get hot but be, depending on like how cold it is but it's got fleece on the inside if you can really see it so you will be warm and then the cute little bell sleeves and then the bell bottoms these pants are like really cute they make your booty look good and they got like the little ruffle details at the bottom the set is 35 a piece let's see We have this cute crop sweater. This is a, well, this was a bestseller for us last year. So I brought it back in this color. We had it in cream, but this color is doing pretty good. And then I really like that it has that Chanel material. And then it has like the velvet drawstring right here. And then it does have a hoodie on the back. And then I really love this little cut detailing in the back. That's really cute. This cardigan is new. Like, I really like this. This is so cute. Like, I like that it has like the little, um, it's like two different textures. It has like that fur texture for the black. And then this is like, I don't know what this is, but it's a different type of texture for, um, in the little nude color or camel color. But this is a cardigan and it does have pockets. Did not know that until now. This top is new. This is another cute top that I wanted for my girls that don't like tight fitted stuff. And we just paired it for with this skirt for to, you know, like make it a little edgy. But it can also be like you can wear it to work, which is another thing. I wanted like some pieces that people could wear to work because I know some girls come in here shopping for like work clothes. So I feel like this will be a cute piece that you can wear to work. You, you can put like some slacks or something with it all-time favorite pieces one of them is this bodycon dress like oh my gosh this dress is so freaking cute and you will not believe like how soft it feels on your body like y'all go buy this dress go check out our instagram I thought someone was coming in go check out our instagram on how we styled this it's really cute so we put this white graphic, no, not the white one. We put the rebel graphic on over it and a denim jacket. 
and we tied it like in the front like it's really cute together i promise you um another one of my favorite pieces is this cropped green sweater i'm not a fan of like really color like i like black and white and like neutral colors so i feel like this was really bold but this sweater is my all-time favorite like i had to get it i had to keep it for myself and i put it on i paired it with this skirt to just like give it a little funky little style and it's really cute you can go check out how it looks on me on instagram this skirt is another one of my favorite pieces too because it's so like so stretchy like look at that look how much stretch that is and it's so soft this is like that suede material though and then we have this is another new piece that just came in so the customer that i had that just walked in she just got these pants and she was an older lady it was so cute she just got these pants and she paired it with one of our graphics i did not think to pair it with one of our graphics it was actually the one that i just showed y'all with that dress and it was it was really cute like it was cute it was cute okay let's see what else do we have that came in new been a really good seller for us i did not think it was gonna be but when you put it on it's like oh my gosh this is so cute like and then i like that it's so lightweight it is 70 dollars, but it's so worth it like it's worth it it's really cute it's got like kind of a high low like barely but it's still there it's really cute there's no lining or anything under it like i said it's lightweight i feel like it's good for girls that sweat a lot like me i sweat a lot and i get hot easily like especially if i go on dates because i'd be nervous so i might start i might start sweating but this is cute this is cute and this dress now this one it does have lining this one's really cute on and it has like, I think this is like that smocked fit. I don't know. And there's a zipper in the back and it has like the little ruffle details at the bottom. You can wear it on or off the shoulder. This one's cute. <clears throat> and okay, so these are the last two outfits that I'm gonna show you. Like this was the tie-dye jacket that I was telling you all about that's been a really good seller for us. This is how we paired it. It is so so cute on like so cute and this baby doll dress this is so cute for fall just wait just wait hold on this hat we haven't put these out yet but they will be available tomorrow which is friday <clears throat> oh my gosh you guys so freaking cute that is so cute together oh this is really this is new too like that's one of my faves like which i'll show you all that another day or you can go on instagram or the website and check that out but <clears throat> these are my last two fades you either gonna put it right i don't know <laughs> you helping out today Say hi to our YouTube channel. Hello, I'm Ruby. Oh, you had a lot of energy then. Okay. <laughs> okay, so the hats are up and this is how they turned out. And we got lots of new jewelry in. What are you getting? I'm gonna get these this shirt. Okay. And I'm gonna get this dress. Okay. That's cute. That's cute. <laughs> More accessories. This is what our table is looking like. This sweater is so comfortable. So many anklets. Okay, you guys, so I'm going to end my video here. Overall, today was a good day. It was busy. I still didn't get to finish putting all the new arrivals up online, but I'm going to do that tonight when I go home. 
so i hope you all like this video um comment below like subscribe all that let me know what y'all want to see and i hope it wasn't too all over the place but yeah at times i forgot to pick up the camera but the more i do it i'll get better okay bye you guys